Steam Series, championed by your Southern California Toyota dealers. He makes a living investigating hidden sources of water damage. It's time for this week's STEAM Profile. Our focus today, technology and math, as we introduce you to a leak detective. The heat maps, meter exams, sound signatures. It's all in a day's work for Sherlock leak detection. Each job, it's like a puzzle. Meet Ron Ben Naim. He's built a business investigating water leaks. We find leaks underground. We have a pipe right here. Running water makes noise, but the source can be hard to locate. That's because sound can be deceptive. When there is a pinhole leak in a copper pipe, it sounds like a very high pitch hissing. And that hissing, because it's copper pipe, it travels throughout the whole line. And sometimes you hear it in the walls when the leak is actually underground. Of all the STEAM disciplines, leak detectives rely most on technology and math. A very small pinhole leak can be thousands of gallons a day because it's under pressure. Something wrong with the hot water pipe. When acoustics don't isolate the source of a leak, thermal imaging often can. And you can still see the temperature difference. Ron studied business in college, then worked for an insurance company. That's where he discovered an unmet demand, a need to reduce claims caused by water damage. Ron learned everything he could about plumbing and water flow and discovered a knack for finding answers fast. There's no two leaks that are the same. Instead of the corporate career Ron thought he would have, he spends most of his time in the field. You discover a need and then you see an opportunity. The thing he loves most about being a leak detective? It's a challenge, but it's fun, it's interesting. So cool. For more on STEAM careers, go to cbsla.com slash STEAM. And that guy is such a character. I love it. <laughs>